has been safety checked. Okay guys, this is the Glock 43 and I consider this one of the best pistols for women because of its size. The width of this pistol is 2.6 centimeters, which is very slim and that's the reason why they call it Glock 43 Slimline. The caliber is 9mm. The grip is perfect for a woman's hand because it's very small and thin. Now let's take out the magazine. This is the standard magazine and as you can see here it has a very flat base plate. And even with my fingers I can still roll my pinky over the base plate. So yeah, it's a little bit too small even for my hands. And um, if you shoot with the standard magazine, you just take down one pinky like that and shoot like that. So Glock has made an extra magazine and the extra magazine has an extended base plate here. And if you insert that into the pistol, you have the perfect grip. So now all my fingers fit on the grip. So the entire pistol is made out of polymer, except the slide, which is made out of steel. The magazines are made out of polymer as well, plus they have this steel lining here to make it more durable. So I prefer to shoot with uh, this magazine here because it's just more comfortable. The magazine capacity of the Glock 43 is 6 rounds, which is not a lot, so you have to be sure that you uh, hit your target with the first 6 bullets. This is the standard model of the Glock 43 and it comes with this standard sights with a frame in the back and a dot in the front here and there is no safety on this pistol. The only safety that they have installed is this small button on the trigger so you can only pull the trigger when the button is pressed down which prevents the pistol from shooting accidentally. So after we have shot our last round in the magazine the slides stays back like this and there's one way, there's two ways actually how you can get back the slide to normal position. You take out your magazine and here we have a button which we call the slide stop and by pressing that button the slide comes into the standard position, in the forward position again. But I have to say for a woman this uh, button is pretty strong and heavy to push and there's another way how you can get back the slide. So now this is the standard position after you shot all your rounds. You get out the magazine and then you just pull back the slide and move it into the forward position like this. And this way it's more silent. So if you are in some kind of, you know, fighting situation and you don't want to give away your position by making noise, this is the way to do it. The trigger pull weight on this pistol is pretty heavy. It has about 5.5 pounds and for target shooting I felt that this is a little bit too strong so I'm going to get another spring to make the trigger pull weight lighter. Okay next I want to show you how to disassemble the pistol. First off you get out your magazine, you pull the trigger and then you take the slide like this and pull it back a little bit and here at each side there are two tabs and you just push them down like so and then the slide comes right off. And here you have your recoil spring and guide rod. You just take it out like that and then you have your barrel and this barrel is about 3.39 inches long or 8.6 centimeters and most of the weight is the steel slide really so all in all, the pistol is pretty lightweight. It has about 509 grams without ammunition and that's around 18 ounces. So it's a pretty lightweight pistol. Excellent for a woman. And yeah, that's basically all the parts that you want to disassemble when cleaning the weapon. And yeah, I have cleaned it before, but usually the barrel is very important to clean and sometimes you find fluffy stuff inside of your pistol, you just take that out and then when you're finished with the cleaning you put in your barrel again into the slide like so and you take the recoil spring 
and set it in place and then you take the slide and slide it on the frame of the pistol and while doing that you want to be very careful that's nothing to be um, brutal with and then you just pull the slide back and we're back in business. <laughs>